Hi, this video is to explain how to repair your Velodyne SPL Series 2 subwoofer. Uh, all of a sudden, someday, you didn't do anything wrong, uh, just you turned on the subwoofer and it's not working. Don't worry, that's not your fault. That's uh, because while uh, Velodyne used some bad quality capacitors in preamp section and uh, you have to just change them and it will be back to the life again. Anyway, after removing all these screws and the knobs, uh, you take off the amplifier. As you see, I already took off the apart the amplifier. It is under the power amplifier. The preamp is right over here, and this is where the problem is located. Actually, what happens, uh, these two capacitors, C19 and C20, uh, are getting bad. You can change them. Uh, but uh, to be on the safe side, better to just change all of them. As you see, I changed all of them. Okay. Uh, in the future to prevent yourself from such a problem. After replacing the capacitors, I strongly recommend you to use a glue gun and uh, glue all the capacitors because as you know it is a subwoofer and there is too much vibration inside. It will hold the capacitors not to be break up from the motherboard. Don't use any cheap soldering iron because uh, that way you can damage the board. I mean, don't use any 99 cent store soldering iron. And uh, good luck with your amplifier, and I hope it will be good for you. Thank you very much.